Welcome to the Ultimate Sports Podcast Special Edition Series, where I go through every baseball team's top 30 prospect lists via MLB.com and discuss where each prospect was drafted, where they are now, their big league ETA, and for the ones that are top 100 overall, draw comparisons to either current or former big league players. And now up is the Boston Red Sox. Their number one prospect is Michael Chavez. He is number 75 overall. He is an infielder. First round pick, 2014, by the Red Sox. He's currently in the big leagues, having an immediate impact, hitting 314 with three home runs and eight RBIs in 11 games. In AAA, he was hitting 250 with four homers and six RBIs, so he looks motivated to be in the big leagues. My comparison for him because of his versatility in the infield. But I don't know if he'll have outfield versatility like this player. But I'm going to go with Ben Zobrist as my comparison for Michael Chavez. And maybe with a little bit more power than Zobrist did when he was in his prime. Number two, Tristan Quesas. Corner infielder, 2018 first round pick by the Red Sox. Currently in A-ball. ZTA is... 2022 right now in a ball hitting 221 with four homers and 13 RBIs in 24 games. Not terrible. Their number three prospect is Bobby Dablick, third baseman, 2016 fourth round pick by the Red Sox, currently in double A. ZTA is in 2020, hitting 197, two homers and nine RBIs in 22 games which isn't great. Their number four prospect is Darwinzon Hernandez, left-handed pitcher, 2013 international free agent signee by the Red Sox, currently in double A. ZTA is 2020, but he had an appearance this season. It was only one game. Four hits, four strikeouts, and a walk in two and a third innings. Meanwhile, in double-A, with a 5.91 ERA, three starts, 10 and two-thirds inning, 16 strikeouts, 10 walks, and 10 hits, and gave up one home run, and hitters written 250 off of him. So maybe the 5.91 ERA is just a blip. Number five prospect is Jay Groom, left-handed pitcher, 2016 first-round pick by the Red Sox. Currently in A-ball, ETA is 2021. Has not played yet this season as he is recovering from Tommy John surgery. Their number six prospect is Tanner Houck, a righty. 2017 first rounder by the Red Sox. Currently in double A's ETA's 2020. Four starts with a 3.6 ERA. 26 strikeouts, or sorry, 21 strikeouts in 20 innings. Gave up 21 hits, 7 walks. Hitter sitting 266 off of him. It's a little mediocre. Their number seven prospect is Antony Flores, a shortstop, 2017 international free agent signing by the Red Sox, currently in rookie ball, ETA 2022, and he has not played a game yet this year. Their number eight prospect is Brian Mata, righty, 2016 international free agent signing by the Red Sox, currently in advanced day. His ETA is 2020. Five starts in advanced day with a 1.4 ERA, 26 strikeouts in 25 and two-thirds innings, 18 hits, seven walks, hitters hitting 188 against them. That is pretty impressive and hasn't given up a home run yet. Their number nine prospect is CJ Chatham, a shortstop 2016 second rounder from the Red Sox double A. His ETA is in 2020 in 21 games, hitting 295. Doesn't have a homer, but he has 11 RBIs in 21 games, so not bad. Their number 10 prospect is Jaron Duran, an outfielder, 2018 seventh round pick from the Red Sox, 
Advanced A is ETA is 2021. Could be a steal. 24 games hitting 404 with a home run and 8 RBIs. That is insane. Even though it's just one homer and 8 RBIs. This guy looks like a leadoff hitter in the future. My goodness, they got themselves a steal there. Number 11, Nick Decker. Outfielder, 2018, second round pick by the Red Sox. Currently in rookie ball, ETA is going to be 2022. Has not played yet this year. Their number 12 prospect is Durbin Feltman, a righty, 2018, third round pick by the Red Sox. Currently in double A's, ETA is this year. Somebody that's a fast riser, but currently a 7.88 ERA in eight relief appearances. In double-A Portland, has one save, eight innings, gives up five hits, nine strikeouts, seven walks, a home run. Hitters hitting 179 off of him, which suggests that the 7.88 ERA might be a little fluky. Number 13, Mike Shawarin, a righty. 2016 fifth-round pick by the Red Sox, currently in triple-A, ZTA is this year. In Pawtucket, five games started, 3.49 ERA, 25 hits and 24 strikeouts and 28 in the third innings, 11 walks, one homer, hitters hitting 248 off of him. 14, Danny Diaz, a third baseman. 2017 international free agent signee by the Red Sox, currently in rookie well, ZTA is 2022. He has not played yet this year. 15, Brandon Howlett, a third baseman, 2018 first-round pick by the Red Sox, currently in A-ball, ZTA is 2022. In 21 games so far, one homer, six RBI, hitting 243. So, a little mediocre. Number 16, Gilberto Jimenez. Outfielder, 2017 international free agent signing by the Red Sox, currently rookie ball, ZTA is 2022, and he has not played yet this season. 17, Travis Lakins, righty, 2015 sixth round pick by the Red Sox, currently in AAA, ZTA this year. Seen time in the bigs this year. One game, 3.38 ERA, two strikeouts give up four hits in two and two-thirds innings. Hitters hit 400 off of him. Not that great. Meanwhile, in Pawtucket, AAA, 3.60 ERA, 8 relief appearances, 12 hits, 10 innings, 10 strikeouts, 1 home run, 3 walks, hitters hitting 286 off of him. 18, Nick Northcutt, 2018 11th round pick by the Red Sox. He's a third baseman in short A. His ETA is 2022. He has not played yet this year because he's short A. 19, Denier Reyes, righty, 2014 international free agent signed by the Red Sox in double-A, ZTA, is 2020. Five games started, 7.03 ERA isn't great. 26 hits in 24 and a third innings, 20 strikeouts, 13 walks, two homers, hitters hitting 271 off of him. Not great. 20 is Cutter Crawford, a righty. 2017th sixth round pick. I'm sorry, 16th round pick by the Red Sox. Ooh, that could be a steal. Advanced day right now is ETA is 2020. 2.6 ERA in six starts in advanced day. 34 strikeouts in 27 and two thirds innings. 24 hits, two home runs, giving up 11 walks. Hitters hitting 233 off of him. So those are decent numbers. 21, Alex Scherf, a righty, 2017 fifth round pick by the Red Sox. And eight ball as ETA is 2021. Four starts in A ball, 1.89 ERA. 19 strikeouts in 19 innings, 12 hits, 8 walks, a home run given up. Hitters hitting 185 off of him. Outstanding. 22, Marcus Wilson, an outfielder. 2014 competitive balance B round pick by the Diamondbacks. He came over this year in the Blake Swihart deal. Currently in double A. His ETA is 2020. Before the trade, 
he was hitting 235, had two homers and seven RBIs in 12 games. And then after the trade in nine games, one homer and two ribbies hitting 143. So a little off to a slow start after the trade for Wilson. 23, Bobby Pointer. Lefty, 2015 fourth rounder by the Red Sox. Currently in AAA. He was up this year. He had an ugly 18 ERA and two relief appearances with the Sox. One inning, three hits, two walks. Hitters hit 600 against him. Meanwhile, Pawtucket, AAA. Seven relief appearances with a 4.5 ERA. 16 strikeouts, 10 innings, 10 hits, and home run, and 8 walks. Hitters hit 278 off of him. 24, Colton Brewer. A righty. He was a 2011 fourth round pick by the Pirates. He was taken by the Yankees in the 2016 Rule 5 draft. And he signed with the Padres as a free agent. In 2017. And the Red Sox got him in November in a trade that sent Esteban Coraz to San Diego. He is currently in the big leagues right now. He has a 6 ERA and 14 relief appearances. 12 innings, 13 hits, 11 strikeouts, 8 walks, no home runs given up. 2.71 batters average against him. Number 25, Brian Bello, a righty, 2017 international free agent signing by the Red Sox. Single A, his ETA is 2022. Enable ball, 5 starts with a 4.5 ERA, 17 strikeouts and 22 innings gave up. 24 hits, 9 walks. Hitters hitting 279 against him. 26, Josh Okimi, first baseman, 2014 fifth rounder by the Red Sox, currently in AAA. He could be up this year if there's some injuries or something. 5 homers, 14 RBIs, hitting 243 in 24 games in Pawtucket. So has a little bit of power there. 27, Pedro Castellanos, utility player, first base and outfield mainly. 2015 international free agent signing by the Red Sox, currently in advanced day. His ETA is in 2021. And he has no homers in 21 RBIs, hitting 302 in 25 games. So he hits for average. So maybe he'll be a big leaguer someday. 28, Zach Schellinger, righty, 2017 sixth round pick by the Sox. Currently in double A, his ETA is 2020. He has a 8.44 ERA and six relief appearances in the Portland team in double A. Six hits, seven strikeouts in five in the third innings and 12 walks. Hitters hitting 316 against him. Yikes. 29 is Yon Abar, lefty, 2013 international free agent signing by the Sox. Currently in A-ball, his ETA is 2021. He has an ugly 9 ERA in A-ball, 9 relief appearances, 8 innings, 10 strikeouts, 10 walks, 6 hits, no home runs given up, and hitters hitting 188 against him. So maybe the ERA is a blip. And last but not least... Number 30, Roldani Baldwin, 2013 international free agent signing by the Red Sox. He's a catcher. He has not been assigned a team yet. His ETA is 2021. He hasn't played yet either, so maybe he's headed for short A or something like that. We'll see. All right, the untouchable Red Sox prospect, I'd say, is... Michael Chavez, he should be playing every day for them because he's a better baseball player than Eduardo Nunez and Dustin Pedraia. And 
since he's been called up, the Red Sox have been playing better baseball. And their offense is starting to click a little bit, too. So he's untouchable. A guy that I think will be most likely to be on the move for a prospect come the trade deadline will be Tristan Casas. I think that he's somebody that teams will like because he can play multiple positions. I think that Bobby Dalbeck is someone that the Sox like, too, and I think the Sox like Quesas, too, but I just think that they like Chavez the most of that trio. And they'll maybe play Chavez at first base long term after Mitch Marlin's done there. Maybe they keep around Rafael Devers or Dahlbeck eventually plays third base for them. So we shall see what they do long term, but... I think Kasos is the most likely to be dealt. Next up is the Chicago Cubs.